We'll begin in Dallas for this week's five-star feature. They're the leaders of not just one of the top teams in Texas, but one of the best teams in the entire country. Richardson High School's Kaysen Wallace and Rylan Griffin are as good of a backcourt as you can find in high school hoops. Oh yeah, no doubt, I think we are. Most definitely, I mean, we both do what we do at a high level. Coach Kevin Lawson took the job at Richardson when Kaysen and Rylan were freshmen, and he says you will not find a more coachable duo. It's a dream come true, right? Everything I draw up works, for one thing. But if I say, hey Kaysen, I need you to do this, hey Rylan, let's do this, they're always 100% in. They understand basketball. They trust me. They believe in me. We've built that over the years. Wallace is a six foot four inch combo guard. He's ranked in the national top 10 and he's committed to Kentucky. Ryland is a six foot five inch shooting guard, a national top 50 prospect, and he's committed to Alabama. They each bring a little something different to the table and they combine to form a nearly unstoppable one two punch. I feel like we're kind of the opposite. We're different because he's a very high level scorer and I play defense at a very high level. So as long as he's getting all those buckets and I keep feeding him and, and if I'm going, he'll get me the ball too and he can play good defense. So we're very interchangeable and we just feed off each other's energy. We play so different that like it complements each other. And then we also don't really care who's getting buckets like some other people. They get jealous of other people. We don't really care. You know, if he's getting buckets, he get the ball. If I'm getting buckets, I get the ball. So that's, we like playing with each other. So Ryland is just a born point scorer. He's a born bucket getter, I guess is, is, the, is the cool way to say it. But Ryland, uh, he can score from all three levels. He can score from the three, he can score from the mid range, and he can score at the rim. The ability to do those three things at such a high level makes him so unguardable. Kaysen is a born winner. Kaysen can score 15 points to dominate a game. He can score five points to dominate a game and he can score 35. He, he guards the other team's best player, gets the most rebounds, he gets the most steals, he gets the most guys involved. Um, and so if you wanna put together the perfect guy to coach, that is Kaysen Wallace. That's, probably, that's why he's one of the best players in the country. He can do everything. Not many people can do everything. I always tell him, like, he is the best defender in the country because whenever, I go, whenever somebody else guards me and they're supposed to be a good defender, like, it's not as hard to score than it is every day in practice. The bond these two have comes from years of playing together. They've been teammates since the seventh grade, and while the temptation to attend the National Academy somewhere else was out there, they felt more comfortable staying in Richardson. It's some stuff you can't really experience again. You know, we grew up with these dudes that we playing with, so we kind of want to finish with them. And it makes it so special, right? It makes it so so special for the for our guys that have grown up with us to be committed to our school and want to be Eagles. And so it's just really great. And I tell college coaches all the time, I said, you've got two kids here, both of my guys have stayed with me all four years. And I, and I tell them all the time, I say, that is one of the best things I can say about them is because they're very, very loyal. Sticking around in Richardson has worked out for Kaysen and Ryland. Not only are they both high major prospects, their Eagles are one of the best teams in America, but they want everyone to know there's been more than just the two of them that have made Richardson a top contender for a Texas state championship. We feel like People think that it's just me and Kaysen, and it's not. So I feel like we got some dudes who are ready to show that it's not just me and Kaysen. Yes. Honestly, I feel like they're underrated. They don't get enough respect because it's really more than just me and Ryland. We might put up a lot of the points, but they're the ones that's giving us the ball, making those hustle plays to get us the ball. While they're not thinking about it just yet, these two are also excited about the future, especially when they'll be opponents instead of teammates in the SEC. My boy Riley, we gonna, we gonna battle it out, but it's gonna be fun. We're not worried about that just yet, but we know it's gonna happen eventually. My teammate gonna have to deal with him. I deal with him every day, so hopefully it's, I pass the torch on to one of my teammates. Not looking forward to it and looking forward to it all at the same time because I'm definitely gonna miss them. I'm just really excited for them because I know they're excited for this for this commitment and this, this journey that they're gonna go on the next step. These two friends are going to leave a lasting legacy at Richardson High School, and they'll no doubt make an impact at the next level as they pursue their long-term goal of the NBA. Thanks for checking out Sports Stars of Tomorrow on YouTube. If you enjoyed this video, 
please be sure to give it a like and please subscribe to our channel so you see all of the latest content.